start up anyway. Okay. Clip up. Bit thermic. Fun though. Yeah, fun. Very fun. So, beast done. Yeah, we did. Nice. So, beast and Peckerton. And Peckerton. And. Olden Park. And Olden Park. And that observatory over there. And the observatory. Sideways. Yeah. <laughs> I was bouncing up and down. Whilst I installed Ethan with confidence. Oh, not a single obscenity. No. I did not no. sound like I was losing it at any point. Didn't actually. He didn't actually say he was losing control at one point. No. No, I didn't say that. I didn't say I've lost control. No. So for those uh, avid watchers of you out there, God bless you. Um, a little while ago we changed airfields. Uh, we're no longer at Dalmore. Uh, we're a bit closer to a little one called Ashcroft. Uh, which is a lovely little airfield. Multiple, multiple runways to choose from. Uh, on this one, uh, we've come for a, a short jaunt off from Ashcroft, and we're just going to fly around Beeston Castle, uh, Beckford Castle, a little bit old park. Um, we're going to have a little look at uh, look at our observatory, uh, which we uh, which seem to be flying over, and we're not overly sure who, who or what it is. So, any of you out there that actually know what it is, if you wouldn't mind telling me. Um, we did intend it all along the journey today. We intended to go all the way down to Devon and Cornwall and do some sightseeing down there, also pick up some plane covers at one point. But the weather sort of closed in, and uh, in hindsight, uh, I'm quite glad that we didn't go for that one really. Uh, it was quite a thermic ride up there, as you probably noticed from the uh, video. And, uh, and there, was a, there was a fair bit of wind. So uh, the nice little gentle Met Office 9 knots uh, turned out to be about 12 to 15, in fact, when I'm landing there, it's, it's around 15 knots. It's a crosswind, um, and uh, I'm up in the air. I, I reckon that we must be needing about 20, if, if not faster knots of, of wind up there. Uh, my son, who's uh, who's sitting down next to me there, Ethan, um, he's ever such a patient lad, and, uh, and we found out he's, he's got nerves of steel for an 18-year-old. So he just uh, he just takes it all in his stride. Anyway, move on from that. Uh, we're just taking off at the moment and I'll just walk you through a couple of little bits. We're in the Orange God, as ever, and we've just uh, we've just waved goodbye to uh, Nick Buckley, who's, who's got a YouTube channel on here. I'll, I'll put that in the uh, description. Um, we've just waved goodbye to his, uh, his Eurostar, which is his solid. Okay, so back to the video. Um, as you can see, we're we're taking off now. Um, full throttle along one three. Um, Ethan again. It's, he just smiles. I don't understand why he smiles. Why he thinks I've got control of this plane, but but he seems seems to think that. So uh, we're we're darting off up to the sky. As you can see from there, there's an awful lot of cloud base, an awful lot of cloud base around. So uh, we we didn't realise exactly how thick this was going to be. There you go. Just giving Nick a quick little wave. Trimmed up the plane a bit. Uh, as you can see, nice bit of blue sky there, exactly what we were looking for. So we decided, uh, as, the, as it was a bit thermic and windy and, and pretty horrible up there to be honest, still around, um, just nip across the open park and uh, take a short video while we were there, see, see whether we could see any cars racing, see if anybody snuck onto the track and, and gone for a blast around. Um, they hadn't done, it was all empty, but at least we could see uh, see all the, all the stuff that's there, including the fake chicane, as, uh, as you can put it. A 
quick jaunt at this point. Um, Spare you this slow, flat countryside um, and nipped over to Beeston Castle. Beeston Castle is like uh, a Beeston Castle that's been finished properly. Had a little look up to the flag. By the time I was coming down, the flag was the other way. And um, oh, I just blew me out. What's this? What's a crosswind landing? If you can't uh, have a bit of fun, and you can see by the uh, look on Ethan, <laughs> Ethan's face, he knows it's going to be a bumpy landing. <laughs> Oof.